What's up guys? So real quick, um, this is about the fuel uh, efficiency of the economy map on your Cobb access port. Okay, Cobb access port. There we go. Um, so right now I'm getting 18.6, 20 miles left, gas lights on, um, and I've gotten 249 miles. So <clears throat> this is one week and I gotta say it seems like it's about the same. This might be the type of tune that really is only beneficial on the highway and at that point um, the car is going to get better gas mileage anyway on the highway. I still could probably get about, I don't know, 300, I'd say 300 miles to a full tank, but um, it's just not really... I don't, I don't think it's worth it. I'm gonna do another week. I'm gonna try one more week of this, and if it doesn't get better, um, I'm just gonna go back to the tune. I think, really, the economy map only limits your RPMs, which I haven't actually tested that, but I do believe it just limits your RPMs, and that's it. Um, it might change like the fuel mapping and stuff a little bit, but I think it's more of like limits the RPMs that your car can get into um, I don't usually go past like 4,000 RPMs in my car anyway, but I think it stops it at like five and a half. Um, so I don't know. We'll see. I will do another video in another week after I do a whole week of another full tank. Um, maybe it was bad gas. Who knows? But I don't think so. I think that's honestly just how it is. I think it's going to be about the same. Um, the type of driving I did this time was about the same so <clears throat> I did some highway and city probably a little bit more city but it was a good mix so I don't know we'll see I will touch base and do another video at the uh, end of next week or whenever I get another full tank so I'll see you guys in the next one what's up guys so once again this is another video on the fuel economy mode um, of your Cobb access port so I have a 2006 Subaru Outback XT. I installed uh, the fuel economy mode probably about two weeks, three weeks ago. And uh, yeah, it's not good. Like, it hasn't, to be honest with you, it hasn't done anything that impressive with me. It's uh, pretty much around the same. So, right now my average is 18.9. I've done pretty much roughly the same two week stretch of like driving back and forth um, and it stayed about the same. So I don't think the fuel economy mode for what I was using it for, which was basically in town and the occasional highway would be a viable um, like gas saver. So I feel like it's probably designed more for highway only maybe. Um, but it didn't limit, I've heard that it limits your RPMs and I got all the way up to like 5,600 RPMs and it didn't limit it. I could have still went more. Um, so I don't know, I don't know what that's all about or what, you know, if that's true or not, or you know, if that's a myth, I don't know. But, or maybe that only works in the automatics because I have a manual, I don't know. So um, right now, like I said, I'm getting 18.9. That's relatively about the same that I would get before. Um, it has gone up a little bit from that, um, but still it's about 18 point, it says 18.9 now. The highest I've seen it was maybe 20, but then it goes back down to 18.9 with more city driving. So uh, I'm gonna swap back to the Cobb uh, 91 Octane uh, Stage 1 2, and that's what I'm gonna use, because I, I was getting the same amount of gas mileage with my vehicle, um, and I had, more boost this did lower my boost so it went from 15 a little over 15 like 15 and a half or so to uh the highest i seen it was like 13.5 um and the lowest was like flat 12 so it did lower my boost pressure but you know it uh it didn't increase my my gas mileage i feel like if you drive normally with like normal usage of your, your your foot and you're not full throttle all over the place, like you're, you're going, you know, real 
normal throttle, like you're going around town normally, not aggressively driving, I feel like you're going to be able to increase your gas mileage. So um, that is it. I hope this helped you guys out on figuring out if you want to use the fuel economy mode or the stage one or stage two or whatever you have in your access port tune. Um, but yeah, for me, I'm going back to stage one and I'm just going to drive around a little bit less uh, heavy footed, I guess. So I'll see you guys in the next one.